Hi everyone, Paulton here, and how are you doing, guys? I hope you're doing great. Um, some of you may know that I lost uh, some of my unboxing videos before last year. I received uh, tons of items from very, very good companies like Corsair, but unfortunately, I lost every video unboxing that I did for them. So I have to reshoot some of the items so that I can share it with you and be fair with everyone guys so here's one perfect example we're gonna unbox the Corsair Vengeance K70 I know it's very late to unbox this but I think it's it's worth the shot okay so here's the keyboard Man. Uh, some of you may know bakit gusto ko tong keyboard na to uh, I just wanna show you guys a little Lang. So here's my current setup. I'm using a K70, a K K90 keyboard. This is the first gen keyboard, and it's doing great, a great job. And here's my current setup right now. And I'm using the Aventador PC. There's my favorite WD X4 EX4 hard drive, and that's my router there. Thank you so much. Anyway, so showing you my current setup right now is yeah. Uh, it's a kind of bit uh, off team, yeah. Because I'm using a, a red, a red computer as you can see, yeah. And I'm using a blue keyboard. So hindi ko naman at papago yung kulay ng K90, kasi yung LED niya hindi fix na siya. It's blue. Uh, so I think it's perfect for this to use this guy here. It's a keyboard K70. It's a mechanic key, mechanical keyboard, by the way. And I'm gonna show you some of the key features that I like about this keyboard. So first thing is, it's a red switch keyboard. So I've been using blue and red. Uh, I'm not sure you try. I, I tried different keys before, but not actually using them for a very long time. I just a sample switches. Pinipil mo lang kung gusto mo But after trying them out, I really like red. I really like red. Red is for me. So, but I'm not saying that you should go get some red switches. Uh, it depends on your on your preferences, I think so. So, mine is red. I like red. Red switch. So, that's one of the re reasons why I like this keyboard. It's a red switch and it's also a uh, aluminum like the K90 here. But this time, it's a black anodized aluminum which I love. I really really like black aluminum Saka brush pa Okay, katapos It also comes in red LED Which is perfect mo mga Aventador build Tino mo naman po Oh, diba? It's very red Ayan. So it's very It will come nicely with me With my build there And with my keyboard here So well, That's one of the reasons Bakit gusto ko K70 keyboard and at the same time, it has a coutured textured WASD and 1 to 6 keycaps. As you can see there, yeah. It ha they give you the option that uh, you can change that specific keys on your keyboard. So mostly if you're playing uh, FPS games, like uh, first person shooting games, so you usually use WASD and uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, hanggang 9 na keys, ah, hanggang 6 na keys to buy items like uh, yun, alam yun na yun. so it's perfect for your FPS gaming so this guy here is built for FPS gaming and while this guy here is built for MMO gaming if I'm not mistaken I'm not mistaken correct me if I'm wrong sorry guys kung may mali man but anyway uh, that's basically it what I love about this K70 now let's open the box okay shall we so Let's pop up the cover here, and it uh, when you open the box, there's another box. Okay, so here's the box, and it comes to curly with the box, recycled box naman na ginamit nila. Oops, accidentally removed the F10 bottle. Sorry, okay, so set aside muna natin to ano. What you get is a keyboard, this one. So let's set aside. Take a look on muna kung ano mga meron. Okay, you get a warranty guide. Notice yan. Then a quick start guide for the keyboard itself. Okay. Warranty against defects. So, there you go. And 
like I mentioned before, I already opened this this item because I did an unboxing of it, but I lost the video. So anyway, here's the package for the keys. W A S D and some of the numbers from 1 to 6. And it also comes with a key remover. Handy dandy. Very nice. Very black. <laughs> so it is matte black finish. And I think the letter are laser laser printed which will take a, will take a while to be, to feed not like printed keys diba nagpe-feed agad yun eh kasi printed lang paint lang yun eh kaya pag nakukuha mo natanggal agad diba tapos you also get a yeah what do you call this pad rest pad palm rest yan yan there you go very nice it Parang same with the texture of the K90, guys. So, it's a rubberized grip. And also, it is, it is texturized para to make sure you won't slip your hands on it. Who slips your hands on when using the keyboard? Unless you're very sweaty, diba? Or intense gamer. Hmm, probably you need that grip. So, here's the keyboard itself, guys. Yan. Very nice, diba? Very nice. Very nice. It's not that light gray, guys. Uh, unlike on the, what you currently see on the video, and it is black. It's a black aluminum br brush aluminum with a very texturized with a very texturized space bar. Mm -hmm. There you go. You see that texture there? There and a texturized WASD and one to six keys, which comes in red. Very nice. So same texture sila nung WSD at saka yung space bar, that different in, but it different in color. It's not actually red guys, it's like a metallic red. So it's very nice to see it in person kasi on the video, you can see parang red, dark maroon lang siya. But it's not, it's like a metallic red. Actually parang, it's not bright as a Ferrari red, pero it's a, you'll see the metallic fe uh, feeling on that shade or tone of red. No? Anyway, tapos you have some buttons here. So, it's, it, it is a mechanical keyboard. And at the same time, it's a standard layout. Ayan. But, some of the p, uh, key features here, um, some of the features here, extra features here, are this. So, I don't know what this is for. Oh, probably this is to lock the, the buttons here. So, you won't be able to push any other buttons. I'm not sure yet. I, I'm, I'm about to find out. And this is your lighting button. So if you want to adjust your bo uh, lighting on your keyboard, if it's too bright, you can press it up to three times. If I'm, in, I'm not mistaken, low, medium, and high in intensity, lighting intensity, and off. At the same time, you can lock the Windows key. So if you're playing games and you hate, you uh, always accidentally press the Windows key and you go always back on your desktop. So there's the solution there the windows lucky uh, there you go here's the lighting button yeah and this is the unknown button i'm not, uh, I'm not sure yet on oh, tapos it also comes with a stop play next track previous track here for your media center and volume and mute there you go so uh, i rather use this lalo na when i'm listening to music like uh, kasi meron din yung k90 niyan eh you know yeah. So it's very convenient guys. Uh, I like it. I like that uh, Corsair didn't remove it on the K70 series. Katapos, uh, before kasi K60 lang sa K90 available eh. Kaya hindi ko binili yung, kaya walang K70 ako nabili. So ang ngayon ko lang sa K60, walang backlit. Tapos walang ganito. So I'm really glad they, they, they did release a K70 series which it's a bin between the K60 and the K70. Uh, by the way, the Corsair logo is very sexy. It's it's also shaded in black. So it's very stealthy. It has a stealthy uh, feel about the, this keyboard. This is very, very nice. Lalo na when it's in idle or not, you're not using it or your PC is turned off. So it's very nice and sexy. But when you start to use this keyboard and everything nice up, it's very nice. Tapos also, you notice that there's a one, two, three, four switch there. Wait, wait. 
post that link. There you go. One, two, three, four. Can you see that? One, two, four. One, two, four, eight. Is that eight? Yeah. One, two, four, eight. I'm not sure why it's not one, two, three, four, but it's indicated one, two, four, eight. So as you can see, you can switch the BIOS. Okay. So here's the thing. I, I wanna explain that part there. Because with this K K90, before I didn't even know the newly released K90, I'm having problem using this keyboard when I'm logging into Windows before. Before, because Windows 7, I don't know F5. Now, sometimes if you're not able to shut down properly your Windows, you have to select parang which one do you want to boot? Windows boot Windows uh, boot Windows uh, normally, tapos safe mode, parang ganon. Whenever I got into that situation, my arrow keys, my keyboard is not working at all. That's what I hate about this keyboard. There. Pero after the firmware update, naman, okay na siya. But sometimes it, when you use this to another uh, another new motherboard, it's it has that defect. Uh, I'm not sure if I got a defective uh, keyboard, but I really got uh, annoyed with it. So, I think with this uh, switch here is that it enables you to use the keyboard when you're in BIOS or in my, maybe in, in, in DOS mode. So, it's pretty handy after. So, halimbawa, ayaw mag-work, tapos ayaw, hindi compatible. So, you should just switch here. You can switch it here, there. Very nice. And it also comes with a USB port here. Tapos, yes. Okay, it also comes with a stand, yeah. so you can adjust accordingly to your uh, preference, yeah. which is very nice. And it also comes with a very nice leaving cable. It, it is very thick, but it is very nice. Yeah, black sleeve. At the same time, let me show you. There you go. It has this parang Y connector na. So, ito pa ang gusto ko dito. The other one in, indicates that it's for the keyboard itself. You can see the logo there. Then at the same time, isa naman para sa USB port. Yan. So, no more parang tanggal, tas silipin mo, tama ba yung tinanggal ko? You can instantly notice it by just looking at the icons. So, easily recognize. Hmm? Diba? Diba, diba? So, it's very nice. So, let's plug it in. Okay, so I'm back and now that we are ready to showcase the keyboard. So as you can see, compared to the K90 before, here, yeah, this, um, silver and blue, this one is black and red. So it goes perfectly with the my rig here. And it also comes perfectly with your MSI gaming motherboard or kaya raw uh, Republic Gamers motherboard. So it's very very nice. The glow on this side, this part here, guys. Uh, I'm not sure if you're noticing it, but it has this soft glow. Unlike this one, kasi parang eto mga to. Pag tininom yung regular siya, parang nakailaw siya, regular lang naan. Tas yung fine letter T, Y, yung edges nyan, makikita mo talaga fine talaga siya. But with this one, dito, parang may glow effect siya. You know, di ba? You know this, that? May glow effect siya, which is very nice. I like it. I like the effect. At the same time, I like it. Also comes with the red effect there. Uh, so, here's the light button. Nyan, you can adjust it three times. Low, medium, and high. Then off. Low, medium, high, and off. So, it's very handy. Lalo na, if you're, parang, pag masyado, ho, nasisilaw dun sa, ano, sa effect ng low. So, you can adjust it accordingly in on the fly, di ba? You can adjust it. No more going to software while you're on gaming. Para annoying yun, di ba? Punta mo sa software para mabago lang yung lighting. At tapos, the Windows Lucky also works. Tapos, I'm not sure what this is. Ayun, there you go. So, it's a, Mm, I see. So you can also turn off, guys. Ito. Let me show you. Let me show you the magic here. Oh, so, here the button here. Yeah, and four percent is. Yeah, you can 
Siyempre, basically, the standard lighting is lahat ng keys naka-light. Hindi mo naman lahat yan gustong pindutin, lalo na when you're gaming, di ba? So, the button here, I do the magic, yan. So, parang ito lang naka-on, yan. Very nice, as yan. We just add, add more, parang intensity gaming effect na feeling, di ba? Which I like. I very, very like it. Thanks so much, Corsair, for this wonderful keyboard. In terms of the feel of the keyboard, it's the same with this one. Um, I really like the K90 keyboard and I really like the K70 keyboard. It's the same feeling, but it's much shorter compared to K70. You know, same features, guys, but with much shorter length. You know, kita mo, ito may MMO, ito wala eh. which I don't really use, guys. La, I like I said. I only bought this one compared to the K60 because it has a backlit which I need when typing in dark. This one right here is perfect because I don't need it. And it also comes together with my key, my build here. So, I guess that's it guys. Thank you for watching the unboxing. Thank you for watching the unboxing of Corsair K70. I hope you enjoy it guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to. You can also visit our website pinoyunboxing.com for more reviews of computer, hardwares, and goodies. And also if you want to watch our episodes, our, our show, tech show, it's on teamtext1.com. But if you want to see goodies like this, and builds like that, you can also visit my website. It's potandesigns.com with an S in the end. potandesigns.com So, I hope you had a great time. Thank you for joining me on this unboxing and see you next time. Bye-bye!